Hello and welcome to the September episode of the Crone Law Firm, Rocket Docket. First on the docket, the Crone Law Firm has just installed a brand new voice over internet phone system. This will allow us to communicate more efficiently to our clients and vendors as we can take our office phones home with us or access them on our cell phones. Second on the docket, Ask Alan the podcast has grown and we are now up to 16 episodes, including a best of series. I've, ex- I've taken out a specific story from our latest episode with attorney Bill Walk. Please check that out right now. I don't remember anything about this except the note. And he said, no free air in KUB x-rays, which is kidney, utero, bladder x-rays. And his expert, his last expert got on the stand and I rolled the dice to wait for the last expert. He said, man, he did everything right. Even if he misread it, he did what he was supposed to, he did, it was right. And he didn't see it coming because I, I got him to admit that the gold standard and the standard of care required him to run LLD x-rays instead of KUB x-rays, which sounds like a technical point, but this guy barked so much, everybody had barked. And this expert, this Vanderbilt former military guy who had just been yelling at me, all of a sudden realized, I walked to the corner of the courtroom. I mean, I was as far away as I could. So doctor, tell me, did he read the right x-ray? No, he read the wrong x-ray. So not only did he not order, he ordered the wrong x-ray. So there was no way he could have read those properly because he didn't order the right x-ray. And the only Perry Mason moment I've ever had like that, <laughs> I put it down and went, yes, he ordered the wrong x-ray. And so by that definition, your definition, he departed from the standard of care, didn't he? And I'm screaming from the far side of the court. Yes, he did. Next on the docket, Mediation Monday has continued to grow as Alan and Dr. Lada have discussed the mediation process as well as why mediation works. So please join us next week as we discuss how to avoid impasse in a mediation. And that concludes our September rocket docket. Next month, we will be talking about our new crisp video shoot that will be happening next week. So please stay tuned for that as we hope to have lots of good content for you next month. And now as we close here, please enjoy this crisp video and I will see y'all next month on the Crone Law Firm Rocket Docket. Thank you so much. I was an engineer in my first life. I wasn't really happy with engineering, just in the cubicle all day. So I decided to move back home to Memphis and started taking flying lessons. Worked my way up and then built up my time and finally broke in and became a corporate pilot. I had been with my company for just shy of 11 years and I was a very happy, very proud employee and was passed over for a raise. Called a meeting with my boss to find out what it was, why I wasn't getting raised, why was I not given the chance to correct this. Before this meeting even started, I was told immediately that I was being let go. I just saw my aviation career just going down the drain. I cannot live with this for the rest of my life and let them do this to me. My wife actually is a co-worker of Alan Crohn's. She suggested him. The very first day, they immediately put me at ease. I felt the, the weight of the world had been lifted off me. I walked out of his office that day, met my wife at lunch, and I was like, we're fighting back, we're fighting back. They were very experienced and very professional, very dedicated. I can't see that anywhere else that I've gone that it would be any better, I can tell you that. No, I would definitely without a doubt, highly recommend the Crown Law Firm.